It's not just college returning to the classroom. Both East Hartford and Wolcott school districts are back for their first day today. However, due to all the heat we're having, they are having an early dismissal. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Aya Galel spoke to families who see how they're feeling about this new school year. For East Hartford families, summer has come to an end and the new school year has officially begun. Not okay. We're nervous. It's the first day of middle school. We're not really ready. Lisa and Sean Matulowitz's daughter is 11 and started middle school today. It was an emotional moment for the parents as they dropped her off for her first day of classes. New school, new system of everything, no buses, walking to school, it's just new for her, so it's concerned as a parent, making sure that she's going to be okay and I'm prepared her correctly. All East Hartford Public School students are being welcomed back as in-person learners this year. We're really excited to have the kids back in the building. Uh, everybody's back. East Hartford High School Principal Matt Ryan says last year, 65% of kids were in person and 35% were remote. Regardless of vaccination status, masks have to be worn inside for at least the first month of the school year, but students can take them off when they're outside. We are trying to distance kids in the classrooms to that three feet. Um, which we, we pretty much in all the rooms we can do that. Uh, the cafeteria is a little different, um, but uh, we just make sure, you know, once you're done eating, you can put your mask back on. And despite the first day jitters, these elementary school students are excited about the new school year. Mostly have um, a fun time at yeah, school. Fun time. East Hartford students have half days today through the rest of the week because of the heat. Reporting in East Hartford, Aya Channel 3 Eyewitness News.